What's up, guys? Another Tuesday, 7 o'clock. You already know what time it is. It's time for the block party. I'm your host, Amber Rockwell. Let's hop into these music videos. And by the way, we got a very special guest, but you have to keep watching to see who it is. Raise your hands in the air. Raise your hands in the air. Raise your glass, pull it up. Raise your hands in the air. Raise your hands in the air. Raise your hands in the air. Raise your crazy, pull it up. Raise your hands in the air. Raise it, raise it out. Yeah, turn up. Yeah. It's the weekend, pull it up, ain't got no worries. Got them stacks in my pocket. Let's go and blow it. Call the plug, get it pool, stack it up with bottles. I got my boys, bring your girls, I step out, they follow. I'm about to take one of them things on the night. One on my face, one on my lap, that's my time. I'm about we about to turn it up, that's the deal. Come and leave me for the weekend, I ain't gonna chill. One for the money, two for the show, three for the body. Time to post some hours Four for the bottles For the fire she on glow Hold up, my cup empty Time to post some more Post some more Dip, 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 One for the money, two for the show, three for the party Oh, we got it going up like, whoa ADJ crank, get the ba 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 bass Make it earthquake, it's really about to get ridiculous So many shots to the head, I'm delirious Hopping my fist through the crowd, I got stamina They cannot hold us down, they cannot handle us And I'm about to take one of them things on the night yeah. One of them things on the night Girl, you're my type, you're exactly what I like Let's get wild, let's get crazy We can do this all night Gusto! One for the money, two for the show, three for her body. Time to post some more. Four for the bottles, for the fire she on glow. Hold up, my cup empty. Time to post some more. Post some more, 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 Yeah. I'm a hustler, 
the bitch, yeah. I'm gon' shine yeah. Okay, fuel to the fire, consider me the refill I spit flames on these lanes, cause damn it, it's my free will Skills been cold, can't cool me down, I been chill DOA was his beat, but you can consider it re-kill Aura on bling, like I'm wearing Mr. T-Tang Pockets in health and money, looking like some low main Great bars of rock, pin stay licking that propane My move be swift and fast, so it's hard for haters to take aim Shows finesse and savoir faire. When you walk by, people stop and stare. You're a stroke of pure perfection with personal flair. Every stitch so fine, you look divine in the clothes you wear. From casual to formal, your image is your passion. With God, would suit you in on time fashions. You know who you are. Let your style shine through on time fashions. With God, would suit you. Johnson Screen Printings, JSP Sports, your source for all your imprinting needs. Screen printing, embroidery, lettering, and numbering for all occasions. Family reunions, class reunions, churches, schools, business promoting, and ball teams. We specialize in a quick turnaround. Johnson Screen Printing, JSP Sports, your source for all your screen printing needs. Call 345-8381. That's 345-8381. What's up, guys? This is your girl, Amber Rockwell, the host of the Block Party TV show. I am here with the incredibly talented, funniest man on the planet, Mr. Steve Brown. Welcome to the show. Hey, how you doing, sweetie? I'm glad to be here on your show. Great things, great things you guys are doing. All right, so the interview today basically is motivation. Steve Brown is from Tuscaloosa, Alabama, so people that think that, oh, I'm from a small town, I'm not going to make it. He is living proof that if you work hard enough that you can make it. So my first question is, mm -hmm. when did you know that comedy was what you wanted to do? Um, <laughs> that's a great question. <laughs> I knew that, uh, actually, comedy just kind of fell into my lap. I mean, I, I, I always had a, a thing for entertaining people. I mean, uh, of course, the producer of the show, he knows that because we went to the same <laughs> church uh, together, you know, uh, one of those churches where you go Sunday morning, get out there Wednesday evening. So, you know, I had all day to practice. But uh, it kind of fell in my lap. And, um, you know, I, I was like, okay, I, I think I could be pretty good at this. And, and then um, I think my blessing came when um, uh, Ricky Smiley, he came to uh, a talent show that I was hosting at Stillman College. Of course, I'm a graduate from Stillman College. And I was just voluntarily doing uh, step shows and talent shows and stuff like that hosting and um he saw me he was like man maybe you know you ought to try to do this i'm like okay no problem so he took me on the road with him and i did a comedy i opened up for him for like a year two years for free for free <laughs> that means i worked for free to, to get my name out there you know what i'm saying and um you know it snowballed and you know here i am today so and, and I, I, I emphasize for free because a lot of the young entertainment these days, they feel like as soon as they get on stage, you got to get paid. And it's not how it works. You have to you have to create a niche. You have to create you have to create a buzz on yourself. And sometimes that's investing in yourself and, and, and going on the road for free and doing things that you wouldn't normally do to get your name out there. You know what I'm saying? Because. You know, all these people, all these young cats asking for, I need to get this, I need to get this. Well, dude, nobody knows you. You don't even have a yearbook picture. So who's going to pay to see you? You know what I'm saying? So you got to go and, and kind of like sell yourself. And then when people start talking and then they want you, then you start, you know, gradually 
give them a price, and it, it snowballs. The harder you work, the, and then the more you market yourself, you know, the more in demand you'll become, and that's that's the way the business works. You know, it's not always about talent. All right. So my other question is for people who. I guess hit that wall or when you hit that first struggle, how important it, is it to just keep going? Like what, what kind of obstacles did you face where you were like, I don't know, this is for me. Or when you kind of had that first setback, like explain what kept you going. Well, if you love what you do, you truly love what you do and you genuinely love what you do, you're going to continue no matter what. I mean, comedy, this business of comedy it's another side. It's actually, I'm a, I'm a 48 year old man. This business has actually made me cry. Okay. Uh, I went from losing out on friends, uh, went uh, out on possibly losing a marriage and, um, living in my car. So they are sacrifices to getting what you want. It's, it's all on you on, and you know, on what you want. And of course, you know, it takes a lot of hard work, perseverance and prayer. Did I say prayer? Prayer. That's what it takes. So, you know, you just got to keep going. You know, sometimes, you know, you could tell if a person really, really wants it or not because the first time they hit that, that, that wall or they struggle, oh, this ain't for me, I'm out of it, I'm out of it. And they're from place to place to place to place. But if you just, you, if you just stay where you are and, and, and just have faith in God and everything will be fine, trust me. I mean, you'll hit that struggle, but you just got to keep going. Okay, so what would Steve Brown today tell Steve Brown in, let's say, high school, college, at the beginning of your career? Steve Brown today was tell Steve Brown 20 years ago, man, I am damn proud of you. You kept going. You stayed with it. You know, you had a lot of naysayers. You had this. You had that. And you still have people that don't believe in you from this small town, you know. And, of course, I usually hear this thing, you know, um, uh, Jesus, you know, or whatever. I, I forgot it. Let, let me get the passage right. You're, you're a prophet is never honored in his own hometown. Mm -hmm. You know, in other words, because you're from here, they give you the hardest time. Right. Well, my answer to that is that's why God made bigger cities. <laughs> Exactly. So, I mean, right here, it, it, I got my mold from here, but mm -hmm. Tuscaloosa doesn't stop me. Because, right. you know, for the few that don't like Steve Brown and Tuscaloosa, there are millions all over America and out of America that love Steve Brown. Right. So regardless of, I mean, I would hate for people from Tuscaloosa to stop supporting me, which, you know, Tuscaloosa supports me well. I mean, when I have shows in Birmingham, whatever, I mean, it's packed with people from Tuscaloosa. So I love my city of Tuscaloosa. But, you know, if that ever stops, I still have people abroad. Because, you know, I've worked for it, you know, so that's what it is. Okay, now, earlier I talked to you today, and you said that you had spent New Year's at Steve Br at Steve Harvey's house. Mm -hmm. and you you're telling my business. And, you well, wait, 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 because I want to bring up a point. I want to bring up a point. You said <laughs> okay. after going to his house, uh -huh. I have goals. a whole new set of goals. Goals, goals. Mm -hmm. I mean, let, let, Amber, let me tell you something. <laughs> if you surround yourself with successful people, nothing but success could come to you. You know, and I, I love my friends, and I'm, they're going to forever be friends, mm -hmm. but if they're not trying to do nothing, it's like dead weight. Mm -hmm. I can love you, but I can love you from a distance. I have a goal, you know what I'm saying? And, and when I saw um, this man's house and how he lives mm -hmm. and how humble he is, I'm like, Steve, you ain't doing crap. <laughs> you ain't doing nothing. So now... Instead of being jealous and envious, I'm looking at it, and all I see, when I see the marble floors and the elevators, and you, you got a house that looks kind of normal on the outside, but when you walk in, you go three stories down. You know, I'm like, goals, goals, chandelier, goals. You know, I'm looking at everything. The hard, the, 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 the tall ceilings, goals. You know, that's, that's, that's on my mind. You know what I'm saying? And then we, we, we talked, and, you know, he remembered me from, like, 19 years ago. I mean, it made me feel good, and, and it's like... A whole new sense of motivation you know so it, that to me it wasn't a party to me it was motivation right. so I, I that's how I looked at it and I just had a wonderful time getting refocused and 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 remotivate you know so there it is so 2016 did you make any resolutions man did I I made a lot of them. <laughs> every time I saw something Steve Harvest house goals yeah I, I mean I mean I made a lot of them and and one of but one of my my uh, resolutions. It was. It's a. It's a um, couple of them, and it has nothing to do with Steve Harvey's house. Prayer, paying your tithes, do less, let God do more. Right. right Simple right. as that. Simple as that. 
Jesus, take the wheel. That's it. <laughs> take it. I mean, the cars, damn, that broke down. Take it. Take it. Take it. <laughs> All right. So, what can we expect from you this year? Um, like from your fans or some events that you have going on? Like, what can we expect from Man, you? Man, believe it or not, you can expect a whole lot. I have um, a meeting with uh, the executive producer for uh, Love and Hip Hop about a reality show that I wrote for comics. Okay. Uh, I'm doing. I'm getting more into acting, and of course, I, I I do I do produce a lot. So, um, you you can expect a whole lot. And I'm I'm going to another goal that I have is to um, spread my Steve Brown scholarship fund to other schools. I it's, it started at Stillman College, but now I have two or three more HBCUs that that's willing to take on my scholarship fund because my, my, my long-term goal is to have the Steve Brown Scholarship Fund at all of the HBCUs. So that's working. It's growing. Okay. Now, for people who want to contribute to that, is there a website? There's a website, stevewbrown.com. You go on the scholarship tab, and you just you donate whatever you want to donate because, trust me, the, the students and our school, Stillman College, is in trouble right now. And we really need donations. We need friends of Steelman. We need we need alumni. We need everybody to you know really contribute to the school because it's 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 looking bad right now. But if we if we do what we're supposed to do, we'll be all right. All right. And then last thing for all your fans, what's all your social media where they can follow you, keep up with you? Oh, okay, cool. Uh, you can follow me on uh, of course Twitter, uh, Instagram, Comic Steve Brown, one word, Comic Steve Brown. Um, and uh, for your old, uh, the older people that's in the church, ChristianMingles dot com. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. So uh, there it is. There it is. So you know, like I said, um, Twitter, Comic Steve Brown, um, Instagram, Comic Steve Brown. And um, I'm surprised y'all with this one. Uh, in October, I have a fight coming up with Deontay Wilder. Be on the lookout. <laughs> All right. Well, I hope it's for charity because it's going to be short. <laughs> I'm, I'm, hey, I'm, I'm going to give y'all a flyer. I'm going to be knocked out on the flyer so y'all already know what time it is. So, Well, I just want to say thank you so much for stopping thank by, you. for thank doing you. this interview thank with you. us. Keep it locked. We'll be right back. Hope you enjoy these music videos. The Black Party TV show. I just want to be the best at everything that I do. I know they don't understand all of the things that we do. And I won't stop going hard till the day that I die. I just wanted to sky, I just wanted to sky. I just wanna be the best at everything that I do. I know they don't understand all of the things that we do. And I won't stop going hard till the day that I die. Man, came a long way from playing cops and robbers I need a post to ride so I cop some drivers Rap games are ocean with a line of divers Head lurking in the deep but I'm still surviving I'm a man in this world, make it all alone Dug and dodging these like I'm Indiana Jones Past the elephant graveyard to scatter bones Learn from Lion King, you ain't free to roam My lyrics are retarded but mama ain't raised no fool Staying close to my they the ones that keep me cool Cool and calm and I'm calm and collect All this love I get, it shows I'm well respected Haters don't want me to shine, well face it I'd rather be in heaven, cause it was hectic Like a busy bee, I'm working for my honey I got the green flu, but I ain't sick of the money It's testing my patience, running from it Keep trying me, I'ma leave your bloody I guess it's truth in the lies, but for real I just wanna be the best at everything that I do I know they don't understand all of the things that we do And I won't stop going hard till the day that I die I just wanted to sky, I just wanted to sky I just wanna be the best at everything that I do I know they don't understand all of the things that we do And I won't stop going harder the day that I die I just wanted to sky, I just to Pray to God last night and woke up with a message He told me go and give him and that I got his blessing I live my life HD definition higher than your settings So what the Sleep to the young and the restless. I make clouds trying to touch the sky. After I ask the last ash, I'm like, the sky. If that's the only limit that they can give, when the are done, is when I no longer want to live. They say life sucks. Tell that, that she gon' need a bill. Like my mama need a crib, and my homie need a job. Instead of punching in the clock, he be. With a clock, told me I gotta give them out. I told them never have a doubt. I get so f sometimes I'm mile high. I just wanna be the best at everything that I do. I know they don't understand all of the things that we do. 
wanna be the best at everything that I do I know they don't understand all of the things that we do And I won't stop going hard to the day that I die I just wanna to sky, I just wanna to sky I just wanna be the best at everything that I do Living in the city with niggas ain't know you right. Pedal through life, I think I need a motorbike. Grinding hard, but they pretend we out of sight. Until I step on the scene and introduce them to the light. Talk down, I lost a couple friends to the business. Back it, then you think I think I need a witness. Trying to set some records in the book, admit the Guinness. Trying to make a couple threes while y'all did it brick it. They been hanging so long. It seems like nobody supporting my dreams. They been faking so long. Now everybody wanna be part of the team. Things look easy, but that's what it seems. My struggle pursuing these dreams. No respect from the ones that I help. So in essence, I feel like I'm helping myself Is it wrong that I feel heartless? Driving through this life, no parallel parking Stopping for gas, I guess that I'm starving I'm out of this world like I'm Marvin the Martian Pray to God for better days Looked in the mirror, I'm fixing my ways Got on my knees just to give him the praise Praying I keep my soul out of this blaze I just wanna be the best at everything that I do I know they don't understand all of the things that we do And I won't stop going hard to the day that I die I just wanted to sky, I just wanted to sky Hey, I need everybody to report to the dance floor right now for this one here, baby.
Now move it on up, move it on up. Now walk it to your left. Now bring it on back, bring it on back. Now kick with it, kick with it. Hop out in, I kick with it. Step to your right, now slide with it. Turn to your left with it. <laughs> it's the king of line dance, baby. Yes, it's the bike that's It's big mochi, baby. So fine, you look divine in the clothes you wear. From casual to formal, your image is your passion. With God, would suit you in on time fashions. You know who you are. Let your style shine through on time fashions. With God, would suit you. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. Steve Brown had some amazing advice. I hope that you guys had a pencil, paper, phone, whatever. Make sure that you follow him. Make sure that you follow us on our social media. And I hope that you paid attention to the part where he said invest in yourself. Advertisement, promotions. If you guys would like to come on the show, come on the show. If you don't believe in yourself, if you don't invest in yourself, nobody else is going to. Hope you guys have a safe week. Check us out next week. The Block Party TV Show. We out. (laughs) 